one of the most important missions uh, that we have is funding uh, the organizations, both private and public, that provide therapeutic exercise programs specific to Parkinson's. You know this as well as anyone, since you've been on the grant committee for as long as I've been here and probably a lot longer than that. Since it started. <laughs> so, you know, we, we see, I, I think the organization sees that as one of the really key functions uh, for why we exist. Uh, so uh, then the thought was, all right, who do we get that, that participates in one of the exercise classes? And I threw out that uh, maybe what we needed to do was find somebody that participates in all of the exercise classes. And I know that that's a little bit of an exaggeration for you, but I know you do participate in a lot of well, those. I've either, either participated in them or I've visited them at least, most, most of them, almost all of them. Well, you know, I, I wanted to ask about your feelings. You've been associated with this organization for, uh, since the beginning, as you just pointed out. Uh, what are your thoughts about what, uh, what the organization provides? What are the important roles that, uh, that we play? I think um, uh, coordinating the support groups and and the ex in educational programs um, are both really important, but I think supporting and, and uh, being a clearinghouse for the exercise is probably the most important. Great. Uh, Julia, uh, do you want to ask a few questions? And then I uh, I've been um, hogging all the time. Not Hagen. <laughs> so, um, Elizabeth, can you tell us a quick summary about the classes you take each week? Um, yes. Sorry. Second. Um, okay, my weekly lineup has changed a little bit since the pandemic started, um, but I'm very glad that Sarah Palmer of Forever Fitness has moved most of her classes online and is now leading about a dozen classes on Zoom each week. I take three Power Moves classes from, with Sarah. Power Moves is probably the best PD specific exercise program that there is and certainly the most widely known. Yeah. I also do a one-on-one -on -one session with Sarah weekly and um, I do two one-on-one -on -one sessions with Adam McGee at Alpha Neuro Fitness. Um, and the Dancing with Parkinson's class has also started back up again online. So I dance at least once a week. That's awesome. I was taking, I was taking tap dance for PD, but that was just a six week class on, again online. That was a lot of fun. Uh, I, I have in the past taken also yoga and boxing, but those were te temporarily dropped from my routine, but may, may pick up later on. Oh my God, that's such a great assortment. Thanks for sharing that. Well, so what made you select each class? Like what made you, what draw, what drew you to them? Well, um, to me, it's important that the exercise that I do be as specific as, as PD specific as possible. Um, my choices of exercise classes depend on the qualifications of the instructors and the evidence-based or research-based nature of the program. I try to be sure I have a balance of kinds of exercise so that the variety keeps me interested and my workouts are not too boring. That's awesome. No, I can't stand a boring workout. So that's awesome that these workouts are exciting and fun for you. I'm very like that. That's awesome. So can you tell us the benefits you receive from taking these classes? Well, most Parkinson's experts now agree that exercise is as beneficial a treatment for any for, for Parkinson's as any medication that they can prescribe. The power moves classes are based on four functional moves, basically standing upright shifting weight, twisting, and stepping. And each of those moves can be done, is done in various positions. Performing these moves addresses ad the deficits that Parkinson's brings. For example, weight shifting addresses balance problems. Yeah. The twisting addresses the rigidity of muscles. And so the benefits of the power moves classes are in fighting those symptoms. The program at Alpha Neuro Fitness works on gait, balance, and strength, and so fights deficits in those areas. 
And the dance class just brings fun back into movement with no judging, no expectations. And dance for me particularly helps with coordination and stiffness. Plus there's a social component to dance. Yeah. I don't, I don't necessarily see that immediate connection between my daily exercise and my daily functioning, but overall I'm convinced that my exercise routine keeps my symptoms from progressing as rapidly as many folks do. Remember, PD, PD is degenerative disease, and if you can keep uh, maintain function, then you are making progress with it, with the degenerative disease. Yeah. I, I was going to ask you what class you look forward to most, but honestly, it sounds like you love all of them for different reasons, but do you have a class that you look forward to, sec secretly look forward to the most? <laughs> well, I think I, I think I would have to say it would be the Power Moves class that Kaz Ochi teaches on Fridays. He is a young physical therapist who has been with, worked with Forever Fitness since he was a pre-physical therapy student, undergraduate student. Now he's a, he's, a, he's a certified physical therapist. But he has lots of experience with Parkinson's, but he also is extremely supportive and encouraging. And he's very creative in the, with the exercises he selects for the class. His style is, to, is very motivating for me. I just enjoy it a lot. Awesome. He acts like it's fun for him to, he, he looks, he looks forward to the class every week. So. Oh, that's great. Yeah. I love that. I, I feel like you already kind of covered this, but in case there's any parts that you've missed, um, why do you feel like this program uh, benefits you? Um, well, I think just what I had said before that it's, um, I, uh, I know that it's what, what I'm doing for myself. It's the best I can do for myself. So in that sense, it, it is um, not only physically, uh, helpful, but it's psychologically helpful as well. So it makes me it makes me feel good at being proactive about t taking charge of my Parkinson's. Great. Thank you for sharing that. Uh, Elizabeth, you, you mentioned that uh, you also take uh, one or two sessions with uh, per week with Adam McGee. Can you tell us a little bit about his program and how that benefits you? Mm -hmm. it, um, he primarily works on gait and balance and I also do some, some strength work with him. The balance, he has various um, unstable surfaces like a BOSU ball or a, uh, an Eric's pad or a, a wobbly board or that, that you know, wobbles back and forth. And um, you stand on, on one of these unstable surfaces and throw a ball or catch a ball or, or throw, toss a ring toss. Um, and it's, it's hard. <laughs> And if you fall, he's there to catch you. But I think sometimes I do fall, but it's very good practice for, for dynamic balance. And then um, for gate work, he, he works on the treadmill or if the weather's nice, he's right across the street from a big cemetery. So we go and walk outside if it's nice. And then I also incur, um, do some um, weight training while I'm part, as part of my hour with him twice a week. Cool. All right. Um... I know we've, we've all been restricted by the pandemic, but uh, are there any particular exercise classes or therapies that we've not identified in, in our area that, uh, that you'd like to see uh, available? I can't think of any. Okay, well, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> Means we have variety. <laughs> right, right. So, for those people who are visiting our website, maybe for the first time, or if they uh, have visited the website, perhaps taken advantage of uh, the support groups or any of our uh, PDEDU educational sessions, but have not uh, taken advantage of the various therapies and, and exercise programs that are out there. What's the message you would give to them? I would say get going. Don't delay getting started on an exercise program. Shop around for the program that fits your needs. Talk to the people in the class. Check the qualifications of, your, of the instructor or, the, or, the, or of the staff. And um, you'd be wise to spend your exercise hours engaged in as PD specific exercise as you can. Um, so I would I just encourage people to, to get go, get it going. Great. 
there are also there are also lots of exercise providers that have gone online and in the, since the pandemic has started. And you can you can um, tune into PD specific exercise programs in Seattle, Vancouver, New York, Arizona, Texas, even Australia. So there, there's also a bigger world out there. Huh? Yeah, and and you have to God bless the internet. Uh, yeah. You know, we found we found so many ways to connect during a time when we're not supposed to connect, uh, but. I, I do believe that ability to find the right online programs that'll allow you to be safe and exercise at the same time is uh, is one of the strange benefits mm -hmm. of this uh, evil time. Yeah. Well, Elizabeth, thank you for like letting us interview you about this program. Um, it's this is really beneficial because it's also going to show people visiting our website for the first time how beneficial this program is. Uh, but before we uh, part ways, is there anything you want to tell people that might be watching this video that we haven't covered? Um, that, that it's important to support PSW in their fundraising efforts so that they can help um, fund these, these um, important exercise programs. And uh, Steady Strides is, is uh, our fundraiser in, in June, our 5K that we might, we're going to do virtually, I believe, again. And, um, but it's, it's important to support PSW because um, they, what they do supports us in so many ways. Thank you. Oh, that, sorry, I got a little too right. Thank you, that was such a sweet response. Chris, is there anything else you think we need to cover before we uh, yeah, I, end I our think video? To, I think we need to figure out why we haven't come up with some lovely parting gifts. Uh, to give to our uh, our contestants or, per, or participants being able to see. <laughs> uh, uh, no, you know, it's- How about a cure for PD? That'd be a nice gift. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll take work, that. <laughs> I'll work on that. 